per attempts handicap. Hurdle qualifier up next. The leg three here at Fakenham now. And moved away from Cheltenham HQ. As we wait for the runners here. Looking to qualify with the per attempts. It's the week ten. And here come the runners. So Luxembourg for Darren Thompson's at top weight. Bell Kenyon for Alex Cherry. Beauty Queen for Martin Leadham. Gold Top for Graham Clutterbuck. Optimus for Craig Beckwith. Prince Sense for Alex Cherry. Fraud for Stu Gray, winner last time out. October Sunset for Graham Clutterbuck. Arlington Tufty for Vinnie Gerrard. Dufty Magdalena for James Shea. Aya Jala Candlelight for Thomas Rogers. Glassy Dolly for Ben Bonici. Lucky Bell for Obi Wan. Spars Corner for James Shea. And number 15, Spritzer Catherine for Thomas Rogers. So, no four places here for you each way backers as we see the course they're away and racing you faking them they start pretty much at the main post as you saw to go around a couple of times as we wait for them to settle down we can take eight fences here over the Hurdle, sorry, over the three miles. We'll get over that one. We really pulled jump at the rear by Fraud, the grey. So we dropped out of the picture a little bit. But we're being led by Prince Sense for Alex Cherry. He's got about a three four length advantage away from his teammate, Bell Kenyon, armed and tufty. One on the inside here is Ayajala Candlelight, closest to us. Green silk, green, light green sleeves, red cap. Wider is the top weight, Luxembourg, the grey. Inside of that is Glassy Dolly. Get to the second. Someone skips over that. And they're followed through by Lucky Bell a little bit wider. Along with Spar's corner. Widest of all looks like gold top out there for Graham Clutterbuck. And the Optimist. Mid course. And the green silks of Duty Magdalena's wide again. Red cap. And Thomas Rogers horse. And up against the fence towards the uh, rear of the pack is. Oh, that's gold top. It must be an October sunset that's actually running really wide here. We've got Martin Leedon, Beauty Queen, Red Silks, we have a cap, and the two of the rear of Spritzer, Catherine, and Ford at the moment. So they're through three. The eight hurdles they have to take, and it's still Prince Sense that leads us. I'm in second now, Glassy Dolly, Bell Kenyon, against the fences, I had Jala Candlelight. A couple of greys together are Lucky Bell and Luxembourg. Still widest of all is October Sunset. Not Duty Magdalena. And four at the rear. Not to be stuck against the fence on his outside is Beauty Queen. Grey Fraud. And Spritzer Catherine just bringing up the rear. So as they get to the fourth, it's going to be Prince Sense that's going to lead them over it. Finally comes. You're faking them. It's a fairly sedate pace. Sensor still leads. Some gold top has moved into second, along with Glassy Dolly. Spars corner. Around the outside here is Lucky Bell, and they finally get to the fourth. Everybody's over it. So with half the flights done, it's still Prince Sense that leads us <coughs> halfway through the race now. Excuse me. And a mile and a half to go. And go past the winning post, as we see from the grandstand here. Is Prince Sense that's going to lead us. There's a couple that are going to go very wide here. And that is still October Sunset. And the first of the greys, Lucky Bell and Luxembourg, running together. And the light green silks of Arlington Tufty as we head towards the fence. Still Prince Sense asked for a little bit more as he goes over the fifth. They will take it well. It's a bit of a sticky mistake there by Lucky Bell. Fraud's bouncing around at the rear. But it's Prince Sense that leads us by about four now to IG, a candlelight gold top and glassy dolly together. On the outside of that is Luxembourg, the first of the greys, and you've got Beauty Queen and Arlington Tufty. They're followed through by stablemate Bell Kenyon of the leader. And we've got Spars Corner and Duty Magdalena against the fence still having a good run round is Craig Beckles Optimist. On the outside of that is October Sunset. Green Silks of Spritzer, Catherine. And two greys at the rear, Fraud and Lucky Bell didn't get over that one particularly well either. So with just two flights to take, and 
over a mile to travel. It's Prince Sense being joined by our top weight Luxembourg, Darren Thompson now. And you've got Arlington Tafty and Nigella Candle right together, Glassy Dolly and Gold Top. So as we come down, swing left handed. You can see the hurdle in the distance. As they approach it now, Prince Sense has uh, just been hurried along into it. We'll take it well. In the rear, a couple of slow jumps from Ford and Lucky Bell. So, Arlington Tufty joins the leaders with Luxembourg and Prince Sense. Easy one, two, three. Followed through by Gold Top, Classy Donny, and I. Giant of Candlelight. Out wide still is October Sunset. As we get down to the gritty end of the race, and it's Prince Sense that still leads. Has been there since the beginning, but he's got Luxembourg for company. On the outside of that is Arlington Tufty. The ones that are going really wide now. Bell Canyon, October Sunset's done as hard as he can to try and stay. Uh, wide. The one that's got off the fence now is Optimus and starting to make a bit of a challenge. So we're inside the final half a mile and it's Prince Sense from Optimus that moves into second. Luxembourg's finding the weight a bit hard to pull but it's Prince Sense that still leads us from Optimus. Out wide still running well. It's go sorry, October Sunset. Beauty Queen sort of mid-pack out wide here is Fraud but it's still Prince Sense the one they've got to catch us who come inside the final quarter mile and the last hurdle to take and it's Prince Sense from Optimus. October Sunset there you one, two, three. Everybody else is being pushed along. Duty Magdalena better jump by the leader there from Optimist on the inside. Coming out the pack now, here comes Duty Magdalena and it's Prince Sense that gives way to Optimist. Optimist takes it out, running on really well now is Gold Top on the wide outside is Bell Canyon but we're inside the final half and it's Optimist from Gold Top on the inside. Pushing through now is Spritzer Catherine. Out wide is Fraud but it's Optimist that's going to hang on to this. Optimist takes it from Spritzer Catherine. I think Gold Top is third. Fraud might have gone up for fourth there. Gray on the wide outside. But it's a win for Craig Beckwith. Gets to qualify. Means the first three that all get up. And it's Spritz, Catherine, and Goldtop also going to make the per temps final. So it's a win for Craig Beckwith. Well done. Second was Spritz, Catherine for Thomas Rogers. Third was Goldtop for Pontypool Racing. Four got up for fourth with Stu Gray. Well done. And Duty Magdalena for James Shea came in fifth.